Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. My name is Jalal Ahmad and in this tutorial we are learning about a problem solution which we uh, the problem which we just passed in our last tutorial. So the problem is that uh, I click uh, this value and update uh, a record that is I will put just dummy data okay now I click update and after clicking this update you can see the value is updated for each and every field for these five uh, fields in the J table but when I close this program program and re-execute this file and you can see the older values are showing me again and the updated values are, are gone so the problem solution uh, the solution to this problem works in three cases the, these three cases are the first case uh, third case will be the case which we just uh, saw the demo which we just watched the demo which we are facing the problem in here and the first case uh, is that suppose you are uh, making we are not uh, uh, we are not uh, know, knowing uh, the jar files and, um, and the first case is I think uh, it's far um, away of our knowledge but let me discuss you uh, uh, discuss with you and we will be learning and uh, later uh, later in this series about the jar file so suppose if you are having a jar file and uh, in the jar file you uh, are having your uh, database file that is users.sqlite suppose this is the name of your database file so when you make jar file and it has such an error so another file is created that is users journal dot sqlite and it then faces the same problem when you uh, uh, it face uh, it makes the same problem it creates the same problem of updating at the same time but uh, when you re-execute the file the values are gone and the older values are showing in the table and in the database so the first case is about the jar files uh, the second case is that uh, often you can uh, when you try to reach the database or when you try to hit a button or um, just query a database query towards the database it prompts an error that is java dot exception dot sql uh, exception and says that database is logged so database is logged uh, is also a problem for, for which we will learning this solution and the third one is that uh, which we just saw um, what we are facing in the last tutorial so I will write you I will uh, show you a solution which works are in these three cases uh, so let me show you that solution so find a try catch block this is a try catch block and after here after just after this catch here write finally and in the block in the body of finally just write a try catch block again and write here rs dot close and also pst dot close so with this what we are doing what we are meaning to tell uh, this program is that we try to reach uh, the database in here and now we are uh, we are making a connection with the database in here and in here we are closing that connection uh, and everything is gone and clear so this is a solution and just write uh, just copy this block of finally and paste it after each and every try catch block so I am finding each and every try catch block in my program and pasting the finally uh, mm, the finally block after that so 
this one may be the last one okay so i pasted uh, this finally block after each and every try catch block and uh, now uh, let me re-execute the file that is shift f6 it will work all in three cases all in the these three cases which i just discussed with you the third case is here which we are learning about and which we are facing the problem let me uh, update this record the record number two that is let me write false let me write hasser let me write the alum and city name is uh, sawat and let me write the name of my country that is pakistan so just click update press ok and you can see this is updated but now we will close and re-execute so that it is updated or not so now the problem is gone and the values are updated uh, for in the in the database as well for all the time so when i close and re-execute so you can see now it is in there for all the time for always so this was about the tutorial hope you guys have learned something new with uh, this tutorial and if you like my videos uh, video please hit like button for uh, just below this uh, video and please read comment and subscribe my channel so thanks for now